Hello and welcome to yet another raw light video. This time I'm testing the version one raw light filter for the Pocket 4K. This one came out in the last, I'd say four years up until recently, the version two was released about six months ago. And they claim that it's pretty much identical except for the infrared filtration is better. If you look at the, the differences, it's it's significant. Um, so the, the V1 looks like it pushes a bit more green and the V2 uh, doesn't. It seems to hold a little bit more um, saturation in the whole image. And that was the kind of the big problem I was having with the version one of this was I was getting a lot of blue kind of purple lips and that seems to be gone now. I did two tests here. I used no ND. Uh, and then I also use six stops of ND, so ND 1.8. And the shift is aggressive on the V1 and it's a bit more manageable on the V2. And if you compare 400 ISO with 3200, you can see the, it's pretty noticeable how much the ND filtration affects the version one. But let's see what version two does. It's closer. I mean, there's going to be a shift because of your ND is going to add either green or magenta, most most cases green to it. But yeah, this is a lot more manageable in post uh, V1. You have to do a lot more work with V1. There's quite a green shift, so you're going to have to spend a bit of time fixing skin tones and post and isolating lips and, and to get it back to normal. Whereas with V2, it's Pretty much, it looks to me like it's good to go. Maybe a bit more contrast, but um, it's yeah, it's in a good spot at both 400 ISO and 3200 ISO. So thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful, and I'll see you on the next one.